these maneuvers are called point roll maneuvers. If you can envision a point roll maneuver as basically a segmented or a sectioned slow roll, that's the easiest way to define you know how to do them as well as the way they look. Okay, we'll pull this around. Come back down the field here. Okay, now a slow roll is a constant speed, uh, non-stopping roll. Okay, now we're going to do the same thing, only we're going to stop it in every quarter of a roll. And that's take the aileron in and take the aileron back out. Now it's the same functions on the tail with the rudder and elevator that you'll have in a slow roll. The only thing is that you're, you're hesitating on all these points. The slow roll he has left rudder, the elevator, down elevator, right rudder, and up elevator. Okay, now to go to a point roll, you roll to the right, you've got left rudder, you got down elevator, you got right rudder, and then up elevator to come back out. Okay, that's the four point roll. We'll do another one coming back this direction. Okay, you enter it, you roll right, add left rudder. Okay, you take, add a roll it again, you stop the ailerons, now you're down. You go to right rudder with right aileron, and then roll out of it again with the uh, with the aileron. Now keep in mind, when you're upright, your first points, as in the slow roll, are always going to be in the opposite direction. So if you're rolling to the right, your first rudder input is going to be the opposite, so it will be left. And then when you roll upside down and, and you take the rudder, of it, rudder out, you roll to the last three-quarter point, you add right rudder, and then you take the take that back out and add a little bit of up elevator, elevator to keep the nose in it. Okay, now to take it one step farther, you can do it as an eight-point roll. Okay, now this is a segmented slow roll also. So you roll to a 45 degree and stop. You add a little bit of rudder. You roll it to 90 degrees and add all the rudder. Another 45 degrees and add some rudder and then take the rudder completely out. Now that's half of the eight-point roll. Okay, we'll come back out here and we'll try it again. I'll show you one more time. Okay, now you, you roll at 45 degrees, add a little bit of rudder. You roll at 90 degrees, add some more rudder. Roll another 45 degrees, take some of the rudder back out, and you roll to inverted. Now it's completely out. Now you're going with the same amount of rudder on the right side. You go 45 degrees, add a little bit of rudder. Go to 90, add some more rudder. You take a little bit of rudder back out on the last point, and then back to level, all the rudder should be out. Now keep in mind, you've got to uh, be able to coordinate the elevator in there also to keep it, keep the height on it. So you add an eighth of a roll with rudder, you roll to 90 degrees with all the rudder, take some of the rudder back out, and back to zero. Now all the rudder is gone, so you're back to the level flying inverted. So you go another 45 degrees, you add a little bit of rudder, so I'm just adding just a little bit there to hold it, Go 90, now I'm adding some more rudder, and in the same way you slowly bleed the rudder out. That's the 8-point and the 4-point roll.